Hey guys, we have an announcement. Final Cut Pro Masterclass from beginner to pro. We will make a masterclass. And if you want to get access to that masterclass as an early adopter, I will give you 50% off. Follow the link in the description and also in the first pinned comment. And then you will sign up for the waiting list. And then when it's ready and I will launch it, you can get the 50% off. So what is my thoughts about that? I see us, because I'm excited that Final Cut Pro is coming to the iPad for a couple of different reasons. Number one is obviously we have another software that is high-end that we can use on the iPad. And the future will tell how good it will be. Same like with DaVinci, probably some things will not work right, other things that will come. So it shows us the path and the future. But another thing that I like to see is we as filmmakers, we have the idea, we want to create something, and whatever the outcome is, if it's the next short movie, if it's a Hollywood movie, if it's our YouTube videos, we have the idea and all of that, the software, DaVinci Resolve, Final Cut, Premiere Pro, all of them are just tools. And so we can use those tools. And I think personally, it's not that I tell you that you have to do it, but I personally like that I'm able to use the tools that are right for the job. So some things in Final Cut will be better than in DaVinci Resolve. And other things are better in DaVinci Resolve. And this is why I'm excited about this because the way that I will use it is, for example, at the moment, Let's say for color grading, of course, I go to DaVinci Resolve and probably I will use DaVinci Resolve as my main software because I really like it. But for other things like the thing with the pencil that you can very fast create animations and then export them and bring them into my other project. I think this is something that I will use straight away from the gate when it starts with Final Cut. But also some th simple things that we will see and discover together will make our editing life so much easier. So am I suggesting that you should get Final Cut Pro? No, I think if you're a beginner and you're just creating the stuff for your content for YouTube channel, DaVinci Resolve is more than enough, especially if you upgrade it to the Pro, uh, the, the studio version. But I think this course is also interesting for all the people who come from a different software like Premiere Pro and now want to learn Final, uh, Final Cut on the iPad or just want to see how it is and test this out for, for a short amount of time, right? I know the pricing is one thing that will set off a lot of people. I talked about this in my other video already. Yes, it's a subscription, but then at the same time, I think that the price is fair. It's like almost the same price that other products on your iPhone is, but you will get more that you can do with Final Cut, right? There will still be limitations and everything. But anyway, I just wanted to let you know, so if you are interested and you wanna become early adopter and you wanna get 50% off, then definitely check out the link in the description, sign up for the waiting list and when I'm ready, I will launch this and everyone who is in the list, only the people on the list will get the link to the 50% discounted. Anyway, I hope you have an amazing day. If you have any questions about Final Cut or whatever, because I will make videos in the future comparing them, Da Vinci, Final Cut and everything. So looking forward for that. If you're not a subscriber yet, definitely hit subscribe, ding a ding and the bang bang gong. And we'll see us in the next video. I'm Daniel. Bye.